So I just get this error for when I just trying to log in on my admin panel. So it's just showing this error. So let me fix this problem. So I just call my uh, FileZilla client. And now we have to find out the config file and the view and edit because we have to use something here. Okay, we yeah, just get it. And uh, oh, where is the file? So we have to type in here like this and just control S, then yes, yes. I think it's gonna update it now. And now let me copy my URL. And let's go to another browser and let's try to see that it's gonna work and not. I don't know, it's just heavy or not. Let me go to files again and click edit and just go to here the view and edit button. Um because I have to check that like it's gonna work and not because I have to see. Reopen, okay, okay, reopen the file. And just let's see it's gonna work and not oh Okay, so it's already saved now here. So let me go to go back and let's uh, go back to our admin panel and let's try to log in. Let's see what happened. And now let me, uh, I already input my username and password and now click on login button and let's see what happened. Uh, that's ring not found. If you see now, I, I successfully log in here and it's gonna work now. So I hope guys you understand. Now let me give you a summary on this video. Like um, a few minutes ago, I show you how to fix, but um, if not, I show you everything. Because I was not explained, but I show you the process, how I fix the problem. So now you are thinking like where you will get the code that I uh, use. I will give you in my video description. And also last time when I just tried to log in, uh, it's, just showing, it's just showing my folder for page. So what I do, then I just get my admin panel. So I just type WP underscore admin like this one. That's why I get the dashboard again. And I was using Firefox browser, not like Google Chrome, because in here everything is there and that's why. So in Firefox, I use because like uh, I can do clear cast anytime. That's why I use Firefox. And I don't like the files data, so I just use files data because now when my clients are using like EZWP hosting. Now let me tell you about like files data. Files data, I'm using files data because of like uh, now I'm using a uh, WordPress hosting. That's why when it files data and uh, one thing that uh, if you're using normal traditional hosting, you will get the cPanel. So just go to file manager and just. Uh, uh, it is the config file, WP config file. And if you're using WordPress hosting, then uh, go to, okay, so you have to click the credential that you have, like a server name, username and password and port, then login FileZilla. Then I hope guys, uh, you will get the option. And in front of like r right side bottom, you will see here the WP config.php file and you have to just edit the file, okay?